Beginning with the class of 2023, all students in the state of Connecticut must complete a mastery-based diploma assessment in order to earn their high school diploma. So let's talk about the requirements and timeline for the DHS class of 2023. You might be wondering, mastery of what exactly? The Darien Public Schools vision of the graduate outlines the following aspirations for all of its graduates. That all students would have the confidence and capacity to be self-directed, independent adults who live purposeful, happy, fulfilling lives, and that they would become citizens who can contribute collaboratively and innovatively to their local and global communities. The Darien Public Schools recognized the need to identify through this vision the skills and dispositions required to raise compassionate, resilient problem solvers and leaders. Communication, creativity, curiosity, empathy, independence, and integrity. The mastery-based diploma assessment will be your opportunity to demonstrate how you have cultivated these competencies. There are four components to earn the credit for graduation, each of which will be connected and embedded to another activity or course you are already doing as a senior. First, the narrative inquiry term paper for English capstone. Second, a project for law and government. Third, the presentation you complete for senior internship. And fourth, two short reflection papers on the vision of the graduate competencies, which will be guided in the advisory program. You will choose two of the vision of the graduate competencies. First, either communication, creativity, or curiosity. And second, either empathy, independence, or integrity. For each of your selected competencies, you will write a two-page reflection in which you describe how you have grown in that competency, cite evidence from your academic and personal experiences over the last four years, and connect your evidence to vision of the graduate learning outcomes. Today in advisory, you'll select your vision of the graduate competencies to focus on this year, and you'll join Google Classrooms. Each advisory will be partnered with an administrator from the building who will be assigned to you to read and grade your reflection papers. From now until November, independently, you'll think about what evidence you can use. In another advisory lesson in November, we'll review the assessment criteria for these reflections, and then you can begin to outline or complete a graphic organizer. As early as November, independently, you'll start drafting. And then in March in advisory, you'll have the opportunity to share your progress or pre-review. Your reflection essays can be turned in any time between November and April 16th to your Google Classroom for your administrator to read and provide feedback. After you join your Google Classroom today, you'll have the opportunity to look at the vision of the graduate and start to reflect. Consider these questions. In looking at the competencies, where have I grown the most? Where did I start strong and flourish over the last four years? And where do I need to focus this year? We look forward to reading all the many ways you have excelled, grown, challenged yourselves, and come to be ready to graduate by the end of this year. If you have any questions, ask your advisory teacher or reach out to your assigned administrative reader or any of the building administrators.